Hey, what's up guys? Uh, today is just a quick little video over um, just kind of what we're doing today. It's the last day my parents are here and they're catching a flight this evening. Um, so today we went to the Wanamaker's Gun Show. It is the largest gun show, uh, I think probably in the United States and it happens twice a year in Tulsa. Um, it happens in April and it happens in November every year. Uh, so we went to the April show while my dad was in town. We just kind of piddled. Um, I think he bought a, a gun, but uh, the gun show is not really a place to get a good deal anymore. It's kind of just a, a manly thing to go walk around and do. Women like it too, but it's predominantly 95% men. Um, so we went and did that. I'll show some footage. Uh, we went to lunch and I think we might get to do an unboxing of a chainsaw that we ordered off of uh, the internet and it came in a few weeks ago. I've been waiting for uh, my dad to get here for us to unbox that and now that he's here I'm sure he probably wants to see it before he goes. So we'll do a quick little unboxing for that and then I'll roll in some of the uh, um, gun show footage as well but just kind of short and sweet today. Uh, we're just kind of taking it easy hanging out before they go out of town. So um, We'll show you some footage This is the largest gun show in the world. We're only halfway. And it's both sides walking down the middle and we're only halfway of the upper portion.
so uh, I'm getting ready to take my parents to the airport, but before I do it, I wanted to uh, do this chainsaw unboxing real quick and uh, I'll get it out of the box and then uh, have my dad come out here and take a look at it and maybe he can uh, explain a little bit about uh, how he found this thing and all that good stuff. So hang on a second and we'll do a quick little unboxing. All right, so what we've got is a Hall's Forma, I believe is how you say it. Um, I believe it's made in made in China. Um, so I don't really know what the story is with this. I think my dad saw it on Stony Ridge video, I believe. And so let's get it open. Bear with me. It's okay. All right, so right off the bat, it looks like there is uh, some paperwork in the top. Some type of guarantee letter. Um, basically, that's some type of deal saying it can fly. Um, there's a little symbol, Chinese stamp there. Kind of looks like a like a, uh, uh, what are those called? A, uh, where you sign something in front of somebody. I don't know why I can't think of that. I have to do it on every contract, it seems like we do. But, uh, certificate for certification, 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 you gotta be. Certification for safe transport of goods by air. Uh, a statement that is half Chinese, half English, and some other stuff. So yeah, just kind of all interesting. I have to read through that here in the wall. Okay, uh, bubble wrap, bubble wrap, bubble wrap, bubble wrap. Wow, that's a monster bar. I don't know what the size of this thing is. Um, my dad bought it all on Amazon, another Amazon purchase, so I think it was on Amazon, so we'll see. I think it's a big one, though. Bubble wrap. Uh, this piece of paper. Not piece of paper inside this bubble wrap. You can hear the girls. Hey. You got the spikes that go on the tree grabbers that go on the front of the unit. This pouch, I believe, holds the chainsaw tool. Tool. Um, Allen wrench and little flathead screwdriver. So this is its little tool pouch. It's got its own proprietary little oil and gas mix. You can 
hear my girls in the background arguing. Uh, looks like they've provided a chain. Hey, I'm doing a video. Chill out. You can ask me as soon as I'm done. I promise. And probably assembly instructions, all that good stuff, its own manual. And here we go, what everybody wants to see. A little bit of oil leaked in the bottom of the box. It's big, that's for sure. This thing's real big. Compared to our steels, this thing is a lot bigger than that, just from the frame wise, anyways. I like two. I like two legs. Yellow and then red. Hi, Palmer. Hi. What is that? This is a chainsaw. Look at this big old thing. And it's blue too. Yeah, it's blue. So this is the Halls Forma G660 third generation of machinery. And it uh, looks like Daddy, there's some Daddy, bar oil that's maybe that's been leaking from the reservoir. Okay. I don't know, nothing to concern. That's steel, so that's actually pretty heavy duty. That guide's gonna go right in there. Um yeah. It's a big one, that's for sure. So let me uh, unwrap the bar. So this is the bar. It came separately. It's a big long bar. There's Pippa showing you her jelly beans. It's gummy. Oh, I'm sorry. Gummy worms. There's a big difference, isn't there? Gummy bears. Gummy bears. By the way, can I please go get gummy worms? We have some. No. Ah. Don't you think you've had enough candy? Pappy, Pappy give us gummy worms. No, I know Pappy gave you all of the candy, but Daddy's taking it away. How can you eat all of that? I'm not going to eat it. You're just not going to eat it. How are you going to give it away then? I'll give it away to other kids who need candy too. How about that? Whoa, that's a bar. Look at the length of that thing. I don't know how many inches that is. 25 inch bar. Wow. 3 8 inch. That's a great big that bar. That is a little lot. That is a lot. Here, let's put the uh, up here. Let's put the uh, bar on this thing real quick. And I think I might have shown you guys in the last video. I what? Show them what? Show them what? Two five eight two. Watch out. My phone, of course. So here it is, and then. That's going to go on there. Something like that or that. So let me put that on. And I'll uh, come back and show you the completed project. Alright, so I uh, had to take the folks to the airport. They are now officially gone. But I got it mostly put together and unboxed before Dad left. So he got to see it. But here it is all in all its glory. All parts and pieces put on. Chains on. It's just needing gas and be ready to go. So 
This thing is an absolute monster. Um, we'll see how it runs. I just bought a brand new uh, steel uh, chainsaw about three months ago from um, Stuart Martin Equipment and uh, they're our local steel and uh, Kubota dealer. I bought a brand new uh, chainsaw from them. I believe it was the 290 or 291. Uh, but anyways, we'll do a side-by-side -side comparison with this and that. Even though I think this is quite a bit bigger, I think this is uh, trying to appear to be like a steel clone, uh, Chinese version of steel. Uh, so we'll see how it goes. There's a lot of YouTube videos over this. And um, we'll check them out, or go check those out. Uh, I'm not going to go through all the specs and everything. I just wanted to show you what we were up to today. So whenever I do a uh, side-by-side -side comparison, you'll know where this thing came from. So anyways, we'll see you guys later. Hang on. Time up on raspberry. Hang on. So I got Pips with me. She's uh, got some allergy stuff going on. Okay. She's not feeling great. Part of the reason why we're taking it easy too. So Pips, you want to tell everybody bye? See you next time up on the ridge, Barry. Up on the ridge, Goose. It's mm. the ridge. You better get that through your head. Do you understand? Okay, you're sick today. It can be raspberries. Say bye. Bye.